Bye. Hello. <laughs> Hi guys. As you all know, I have been here in Shanghai for, wow, I think two weeks at this point. I'm not sure if you'll be watching this after I get back or while I'm here. I did something amazing yesterday. I went to Miniso. I'm looking up because I feel like my neighbor is gonna watch me film this. They have one in Vancouver and I live in Toronto, so that's an unfortunate turn of events. Be sure to keep watching and find out what I bought. The first thing that I got was actually the most exciting thing. It is this purse. It's so pretty. It's a bucket bag. It has a long strap like this and a little tassel on here. I can actually have the tassel like to the side or at the front. This was 29 RMB. It's pretty spacious and it just clips at the front and I can adjust the strap as well too. Okay, next up are, I guess I have a little bit of a color theme going. I don't know, maybe just for these two items, but Let's see. So next up are these adorable slides. They are rubber slippers that I got from Mini So. I'm in love with this color. They are very comfortable. I was in the store and I saw them and I knew I needed them. My godmother stole my Nike slides. See you, Carol. And because of that, I haven't had slides to wear at home. So I got these pair, but honestly, they're way too cute to just wear inside. So I may go back and buy a few other pairs. They had them in a very cute mint green too, so. Ooh, my alarm's gone off. These shoes were 15 RMB. So I also got sunglasses. Take a look at these. Ooh, I'm gonna try them on. Bam. Obviously nobody can talk to me uh, when I have these on. I absolutely love these sunglasses. These sunglasses were 20 RMB. They are definitely worth the price. The quality feels great. And I got myself some hand sanitizers. These are so cute. They're itty bitty, they're tiny, they're adorable. I got them in, the first one's in lavender. The other one is in ocean, which I'm not even sure what they smell like. I just really wanted them. But I need to smell what ocean smells like. Mmm. Ooh, super simple, fresh smell, just like what I wanted. So ocean and lavender, and what I really like is that they come already in their teeny tiny um, rubber silicone holders. That makes life way easier when I'm out there. It's the most annoying thing when I have to dig in my purse for my hand sanitizer or it's opened in my bag. That's the worst. They were 10 for, or sorry, 10. Yeah, 10 for two. Okay, next is something I actually went to Miniso for and needed, which was a mouse. I decided to not be as boring anymore and to actually get something that's pink. My roommate already has one. She said that it's great quality and it's worked really well. And I didn't want anything too expensive since my other one just decided to die. So this was only 25 RMB for this baby. This one's kind of boring. <laughs> um, it's uh, toothbrushes. These are just three toothbrushes, but what I love about them is that they all come with their own individual, I guess, snappy traveling sized sanitary holder thing. I don't know. <laughs> Their own little case for the brush head. This was 10 RMB. Oof. Next up is actually an essential for Shanghai. Um, I knew not to buy one before I got here or to bring one with me, and it is an umbrella. So um, this is 29 RMB, which is about the same price that I've seen it in like Carrefour, the grocery store, where everything's pretty cheap. And here I can pull it out too. Look at that. Oh, I didn't even know it was this big. It's pretty big. I like it. And as well, on the inside, it's black, which I didn't know either. Next up is a sunglasses holder case. This was 15 RMB. Um, it was just sitting underneath the sunglasses that I bought, and I thought, this is really smart. I'm right here. Why not just grab them? So I did. It looks small, but it actually opens up into a bit of an envelope, which I love. 
I got a iPhone 6s Plus case. Uh, this case is an ombre. I've been loving gold a lot lately, so these are just, or this is just great. And it was only 10 RMB. A phone case like this in Toronto will cost way more. Last but not least are pens. You guys already know I'm studying Mandarin here in Shanghai and unfortunately these big pens that I brought with me are absolute trash, like complete trash. So I decided to pick up a few pens from Mini so they don't match because I didn't realize that they were 3, 4, 10 RMB. That is it for this haul. So I got everything for 175.30 RMB, which is $35.06 Canadian. Definitely be sure to comment down below what your favorite product was from this haul, guys. Thank you so much for watching and subscribe. I am here in China for a month and I'm going to be coming out with a bunch of content as I go along. Okay, guys, until next time, just go.